Ben Ren. Um, I have a uh, tutorial for you. It's a really quick one, and I've been getting it a lot, so I decided to finally make a video. Really easy. Um, I'm going to show you how to apply eyeliner. And if you've seen any of my videos, you'll probably see this exact same product, which is um, Revlon Color Stay Liquid Liner, and I use Black is Black. And I've been using liquid liner since I've probably, probably since middle school. I just love how it gives you such a precise line. It's very black and it, um, it just kind of defines your eyes and completely can change your eye shape. And, you know, I grew up with my Asian features and, and, um, I kind of wanted to play them up the best way I could. So I've been lining my eyes and I'm going to show you a few simple tricks just to how, how I line my eyes and this might not work for everybody, it depends completely on your eye shape and your preference, but I'll show you what I do. So what I usually do is I take my hand and I actually brace it on my cheek to give me some leverage, um, that way I my hand doesn't shake when I'm putting the line on and it's, I kind of just like, you know, make a fist and rest my knuckles on my cheek and then I hold the pencil like it hold the liner like it's a pencil and kind of go like like th that see resting and then pointing so when you take the ball make sure to shake it up so that way you get an even liquid line and it's best with when the um, point of the eyeliner is still kind of fresh after a while when it gets like too soft, um, the line doesn't get as sharp. But see, see how I'm bracing my hand. Whenever I apply liquid liner, I start at the inside and I bring it to the middle like that. I actually apply a thicker line than most people because the way my eye shape is is that it will disappear. See how it tucks under if I don't apply a thicker line. So, I apply a thicker line pretty much up to the middle to the outer third and then I take it and I flip it, I kind of flip the pencil over the tip and then I swoop it back. And then I just fill in anything that I didn't get. See like that? Sometimes I'll mix it up and I'll make it a longer shape like that. And you want to make sure to, I just will run it back and forth until this line is completely smooth. Now, I know it's, it might be harder said than done, but if you practice this and you brace your hand on your face, you'll be able to get a smooth line in no time. But make sure that there are no gaps between your eyelashes and the line because that's just not cute. See how there's some gaps right here? you want it to be a, a thick black line so that's what it kind of looks like I kind of did an extra wing on that but usually when I do it I'm going to do it on this side I just, this is how I actually do it like that and then I finish it up that's what my line usually looks like it's more of a subtle swoop as opposed to an ink like um, a diagonal line so let me zoom back so you can kind of see it okay so this is a really dramatic one but sometimes in my videos I do really dramatic cat eyes and the liner has to extend and then this one's more of like my normal eyeliner look see how I'm just going back and forth just making sure that the line is straight and you might have to reapply get the brush a little bit more wet because when eyeliner that's liquid dries and you try to go over it with a dry tip it kind of erases a little bit so that's how I apply my liquid liner um, I don't know if I really helped you just really key tips to remember um, I like to use um, eyeliners that have a stiff felted point like this and I've used MAC, I've used a lot of different brands, but I've always come back to Revlon because this liner does not budge. 
like it doesn't fade, it doesn't go anywhere. Um, and the second brace, it helps to brace your um, your hand on your cheek, and then you use this like a pencil. And I start, and I go three fourths to the middle, and then I start at the, an angle here and kind of swoop back and connect. And if the line is crooked, just kind of like go over the whole thing in a smooth motion. Some people might have a little bit looser eye skin than me, so I suggest kind of lightly pulling your eye like that, um, because that way you, it won't be, you know, it won't be such a hard surface to work on. Just the key to liquid liner is to make it smooth, you know, otherwise this doesn't look good. Um, but I like it. I, I wear liquid liner probably 90% of the time, so um, here it is. Like I said, this one's more of a dramatic cat eye, and this one's just like a little swoop. And that's how I do my liquid liner. So if you guys have any questions, um, let me know. I'm going to go ahead and throw on some eyeshadow so you can kind of see what it looks like. Because right now I know it might look really thick to some, but that's just my preference to wear it. Um, and I just, some people, like a lot of makeup artists will tell me, you know, you shouldn't wear such thick liner if you have small features and small eyes. But I don't care. I just do whatever I want. <laughs> and I think it looks good to me. So I'm just going to take a little bit, like maybe two easy colors. I'll take blue and black, and I'll show you what it looks like with the liner. Okay, see that was a really light application of eyeshadow, but already you can see how it helps, you know, it helps to define the eye makeup, and it gives you a little bit of extra exoticness, if that's a word. Um, let me do the same thing with the other eye. Again, I put my eyeliner on last because shadows tend to um, just kind of dull out the line, and I like when the black of the line is very black. If it's a little bit too harsh for you, um, you could also do brown or black brown. But I just like the, the look of the black. I don't know if I really helped you guys with this video. I just kind of felt like I was rambling a little bit. But, um, you know, this is how I do my liquid liner. And, uh, let me know if you have any questions. So this is, see how it looks better when there's eyeshadow on. Um, if your eyes don't kind of fold over like mine, you don't have to do the line as thick. I think it will look better if you do it thinner. Because um, I've, I've had to modify how I apply a liquid liner on different eye shapes on my friend. Um, and this is how, if you have eyes like mine or if you like the way I wear my liner, this is how I do it. So that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Ciao, Bella.